Welcome back to the vlog. Today Bella and Riggs are matching and we're just doing a day with two kids and a day in the life. So we are gonna take you with us. We do have to take Riggy to the doctor. And then Bella, what are we doing? Going to the library. Bella wants to go to the library because Lauren keeps talking about it. So we're gonna do both. The Easter Bunny came for you. It's the green basket. Green basket? <gasps> Look, it's an Encanto water bottle. How do you know you like Encanto? Oh. <gasps> Are those your Kinder eggs? I take it. You wanna take a couple with us? Mm. Did the Easter Bunny do good? <gasps> oh my goodness, you got spoiled. Mm. Ricky's like, what about me, Mom? All right, take put what you want in that bat or in the bucket. You can take it with us. Okay. Mm. I think. Is it coming off? Oh, because it's the wrong one. Oh my god, Lauren's getting drenched. So we're currently trapped in a hailstorm. Um, Lauren had to take Riggs out in the middle of the storm because he's got an appointment. Um, but it's hailing so bad we had to pull over. It's actually, we're supposed to get more tornadoes. I don't know. This came out of literally nowhere. It's not even on the radar. Holy sh... So that was lightning. Good job. Stay buckled. I'm trying to see, we're of course late for our appointment. And I'm trying to see if we, uh, if we have to reschedule or if they'll take him. It's letting up now though, so we might be okay. But they close at noon and it's noon and we just got here. Okay, we're gonna have to run in. Are you ready to get wet? We just left the doctor. We did. I loved this lady. Everyone here is so amazing. We love our pediatrician. Like, literally, we we don't even see our pediatrician. We just see the nurse practitioners, yeah. and they are my favorite. Um, anyway, she agrees with me. He has horrible Last thoughts. night was rough. I was up from 5 until 9. Yeah. This and I was morning. up before then. So, well, we do decent taking shifts, but yeah. still, it's just, he's miserable. He's I, miserable. He's sick. He, I went in there, and I tried not to cry, but I was like. You cried. Yeah. But it's okay because she was so sweet and she goes, I know how it is. I said, I'm just really, really worried about him. So his head bobbing that I was worried about, it's not respiratory, it's reflux. Yeah. And she said, I'm not going to make you do this elimination diet. She goes, I know what that, that is. So they gave him medicine. So we're going to go try so that. So we're going to try that. She goes, I'm a new kid and within the certain time, 72 hours. Then I have to eliminate pretty much everything for my dad. I don't know what I'm going to eat. I can't have dairy. I can't have soy. I can't have caffeine. At I can't that have point, chocolate. I think you just exclusively do formula. If it helps him. Um, and then we switch his formula at the same time, she said. Yeah. Which we would have to switch to a soy formula. I said, should I do it now? She goes, no. She right. Goes, We've been trying so much. He's just, he's inconsolable 24-7. And I said, he's really grunt. And she did the bicycles with him and oh, yeah. tried. She tried and she heard him massively grunt. Yeah, he's like, a grunter. Like, and it's, it's stuff that like normal babies don't do and that's why we both were starting to get so concerned was he was gasping he was head bobbing he was grunting 24 7 like just signs of a not yeah Bella be careful and with him the made me feel better that she said that the head bobbing is 100% reflux it's yeah. in his mouth and he's well last night he was head bobbing a lot and I, I really didn't want to go to bed I noticed it mainly after every feed um I don't necessarily notice it when he's not feet like or after like just normal but after every feed he definitely has it so and she said that's reflux she goes my baby said that both her kids were really really bad refluxy too they had to get on famotidine and she had to do so the they gave it, but they gave us medicine yep so we need to go pick that up yep it's at the pharmacy you told me should we give it to him at night though nope she said give it in the morning okay because he's doing it more at well, night we'll probably do it this afternoon yeah. as soon as he gets it i'm not withholding it oh, and then no. we'll start in the morning okay. it's just once a day it's 0.2 mls it's itty bitty okay. bella where would you like to go to lunch? I don't want pizza straight. Mm -hmm. I don't want pizza. I don't want that either. Well, you and I can get something else. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's go. You want some sushi? No, I don't like sushi. I don't like sushi. Have you tried sushi? Yeah. All right, give her another option. Mm -hmm. Um, Do you want canes? Uh, canes? What's canes? Do you want chicken fingers? No. <laughs> what do you want? Do you pick? Oh, I can pick? Pick for me. Pick for you. How about I read you off a bunch of options? 
Maybe uh, expand our palette versus McDonald's. Wendy's. Yes. Huh? McDonald's. Yes. Why is she talking like that? Do you want Dairy Queen before I throw it out there? No. McDonald's. Jack in the Box. No. Yes. You don't even know what Jack in the Box she, is. She heard in the box, she's thinking toy. Yes. I would say Have fire. You a Chick-fil-A? Yes. I, I don't want to. We always do Chick-fil-A though. Well, but yeah, if we just go in that area, there's yeah. so much food we can just pick. You from. just want your buffalo mac and cheese. Yes, I do. I would say firehouse, but she won't eat it. Yeah. And we are all here. Riggy. Are you ready to have fun today? What else do you want to do? So he decided to wake up and be hungry right before we left. So no one's left yet. We've been here forever. We have been here forever. Touch his hands. Honestly, we've probably been in the car longer than we were in the restaurant at this rate. Oh, we were 100%. Why'd you touch the cheeks a little? His cheeks started getting to him. Bella whacked him. She wanted to help burp. burp. She wanted to help burp him burp, and um, I feel like that was a little bit of assault. <laughs> Hold on, baby. Hold on. I got to burp. Yeah, we gotta be careful. All right, so where are we going after this? Library? Library. That is true. Now are we, Bella? To the library. Yeah. Did you been here for? Excited. I just had a baby, and I'm anemic. Lauren won't let me donate blood. <laughs> I don't think anyone wants your blood. I don't want really want my blood. Hey, right, Bella. What? You ready to go get books? Uh -huh. I'm gonna get. Are you gonna get a book? No, I have several. <laughs> that I still need to read. Are you gonna get a book? Hey. I have a nasty habit of just getting all the books and never reading them, but it makes me feel good to get them. Really? Yeah. Comes from the one who goes to Barnes and Noble and spends a crap ton of money and never touches them? I just said that. Okay. I literally just said that. Do you not listen? <laughs> all right, Belly. I got it. Let me push. Bella. You want about something? Like, there's a certain book you want about something? Let's get Big Sister books. Yeah, you want Big Sister books? Let's see. Um, I'm not going again. Baby from another planet? That's what we're going with? Yeah. Oh, Unicorn. Yes. Okay, you can get as many as you want. What's wrong? He says good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Alright, let's leave him. Doesn't know her freaking water. I was gonna say, I think it was a Lauren issue. I guess I should get the baby, huh? Come on, Riggy. Those are MAs. Okay, somebody over here. Oh, go to Lauren. The name is M U N. Well, here's one. Do you believe in unicorns? Yeah. Here, take it and set it down. Just put it right there. See, look. See? Now put the next one down. You just put them down like that. Oh, it's got it. Next one. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and pick out the baby yeah. book. Good job. The last one. This these, one. Nope, that stays there. That one didn't scan, these two. So you got all these. Oh. Get your receipt. Dip, dip. There you go. Good job, Bella. You excited? Yeah. First library trip? Hey, um, hey, mama, we need gas drops. We need gas drops. <laughs> What'd you get? What'd you get? A, A squish of those backpack that won't zip. That's what you wanted. Hey, is it soft? Now what? Excuse me, we're not going in there. We don't go on the road without a hand. Hey, what do you want to do now? Yeah. Go grandma's? Uh-huh. Okay, let's go. Okay, so basically Lauren stayed back with Riggs because he has not been sleeping well and we gave him his new medicine today so she wanted to like see how it was. So I'm taking her back and then we'll take you on our nightly routine with him. Um, and try to get him calm and early to bed because we are all exhausted. Um, the tub was black. Okay. All right, you ready for our, our nighttime routine? 
Yeah. So we just picked up the outlet and we're trying to figure out how to set it up just because he's been really sick and we keep having to go to the doctor. I think it just would help us sleep at night. Scooby, stop licking your paw. What? Okay, so <laughs> this vlog kind of took a turn. It was gonna be a day in the life of with Bella and Riggs, but if you don't follow us anywhere else, he does not sleep, no matter what we do. And so we're not sleeping at all. So we're exhausted. I don't think anyone prepares you for the no sleep you get. And we are trying to adjust the best we can. I work tonight. Um, I still have to pick up shifts at the hospital to keep my PR in status. And since I didn't pick up any in March because he was born, um, I have to make him up in April. So I'm literally running on no sleep. I will not sleep for the next 24 hours, which is absolutely insane, but it is what it is. I need an energy drink. I'm really chugging energy drinks left and right. I did spoil myself and I ordered a Peloton bike t last night at like 4 a.m. Impulsive and 4 a.m. maybe. However, I really wanted one. They've got a deal. Uh, I, we're gonna try it out. Lauren really was excited too. But we have yet to master the whole um, on and off sleep. And like we sleep when he sleeps, but it's just still not enough. Like he's barely sleeping. At the end of the day, like I'm, I'm just so tired. Oh my God, and everything won't stop beeping. So I'm gonna go get ready for work. I'll take you with me. The vlogs right now are just really weird and I'm sorry. We're trying to do like a bunch of day in the life of, but like truthfully, our lives right now are so sleep deprived. We're trying to figure out how to survive and we're like in survival mode. So it's really hard to push out content right now. I feel like the first week, yes, we were really tired, but we were like, it was like adrenaline in a way. And now we are just so exhausted that we're just in, we're pure survival mode. And with Bella yesterday, it was fun, but no one slept last night. And so everyone's just napping right now cause he's out, but he will only sleep if you hold him. So we take turns sitting up, holding him sleeping so that the other person can sleep right now. And it's just, it's a lot, so. But let's go get ready. Also, we, he, oh, backstory. I'm gonna go break the washer if it doesn't stop beeping. We got Playtex bottles because he has been having a lot of acid reflux and he's on prescription medicine now. These gag him out. So if your baby is very acid reflexy or GERD, or whatever colic i would not get these these gag him out the flow is way too hard so we're back to dr brown's i'm so tired do you hear that the, they won't stop beeping i'm just gonna like break the door off so lauren's finally up when i left you guys i was getting ready for work because we uh are trying to sleep sleeping's not going well in this household it is for him as long as he contact naps. Yeah, which means one of us has to be up 24 seven. Yeah, we just take shifts. Which I didn't think was an actual thing, but he does not sleep unless you're holding him. Like she, she, he was literally asleep when we tried to set him down to film this and he lost it. Mm -hmm. I think we're gonna get a rocker. I feel like that would be very beneficial for us. Yeah. Also, we're still dealing with the acid reflux. We're only on like day one of the new med. Yeah. And so he's still gassy. But I do refluxy. feel like last night it did help. Like. We weren't unconsolable, but we I were, like this today, morning was rough. This morning from like 5 a.m. to 10 a.m., he was pretty grouchy and like whiny, but it wasn't inconsolable like it had been the past I day. feel like he's not been grunting as much. Mm -mm. He would like literally grunt so loud. He has not been grunty as no. much. And he literally just ate and he has not grunted. Yeah. So He's done really well with that. Or head bobbing. Yeah. He was head bobbing and we both got pretty scared because... That's one of That's the first times they tell issues. you. And I went to the went to the doctor yesterday, and she said no. It's just if it's after he's eating, um, it's the reflux, and he's trying to get it down. So it made me feel better. Oh, I do feel like he's doing a little better. I'm excited. Like four days from now, she said we should have a whole new baby. Yeah. So I'm excited to see. Like, do we stop the whiny, grouchy? Like, I just want him to be able to sleep and be comfortable. Yeah. Like, well, he's past his birth weight finally, so no more weight checks for now. Yeah, he was 8.8 .8 pounds, so he gained, which is so good. I was so scared he didn't gain because he's just been so refluxy and not feeling well. Yeah. But my man, did he eat today? He had two and a half ounces, then another ounce, 
30 minutes later, then another ounce an hour later. Like he just yeah. ate and ate and ate. He's still clustering a lot. He is and that's okay. But now he's had a three hour nap and then he just ate for 30. Yeah, we finally got some sleep, all three of us. We only ever sleep. We slept from like what? Probably uh We only get one sleep in. We had the day. a nap from one to three because our food. Yeah. We only get one good sleep a day and that's including nights. And I feel like it's at two to five or five to seven. Yeah. And we did one to three today because you have to go yeah. to uh But besides that, that's all we're that's the only consecutive sleep we're getting. Okay. Yeah. So he's anyway. getting all the sleep. So I said, cause she's about to leave. Yeah. And so I have a movie wrap. I tried to movie wrap him yesterday when you were gone. Didn't work as a different video. It, he was falling through. Yeah. But I found the original video. Okay. And so all of that worked. I'm gonna movie wrap him. Cause I have to, I have to get, we have, we yeah. have to wash laundry. Well, and our videos will get more exciting. I just feel like right now, we, this is our first one. And so we're still trying to figure out like how to do it, how to get sleep, how to our, survive. Like our we're routine, still in survival mode, I feel Our routine, like. we don't have one. No. But I feel like we're still in survival mode and with that it's really hard to like do stuff with you guys because we're barely getting enough sleep to even like help us. Yeah. But look, Riggy, when you watch this back, just know we love you, but man, some sleep would be nice. I know, but they're only this little once. I know. And so all the contact naps, that's what I keep telling myself. He's only this little once. He's only gonna need to sleep. I know. This well I'm not like upset about it. I just sometimes you just need to sleep. Anyway, we love you, Riggy. Good luck, Riggy. Good luck, Mom. Please sleep, baby.